So I've got another design challenge. I've got an enclosure for my filtration system for my 3D printer. I need to design and print a couple hose adapters to go with my Ultimaker S3. I have a pretty small space. I've got an office shed that I built. It's 10 foot by 10 foot. And as you can see, I can basically reach out and touch my 3D printer. I love getting to work in this space, but I wanna be able to run my 3D printer all day, but the fumes and the noise are kind of getting to me. A little bit of research shows it's good to be printing, even with PLA, in well-ventilated areas. So for me, I do have some lung issues. I'm super sensitive, and if I'm gonna spend a lot of time around this device while it's printing, I wanna have a ventilation system and I wanna have a filtration system to, to clean that out. So I reached out to the guys at printedsolid.com. Uh, no affiliates or promos, promotions here, just I uh, reached out to them and they were super helpful. They sell an enclosure for the Ultimaker S3. I ordered that, got that installed. It's about an hour or so of assembly. It's not terribly difficult, but the thing they did recommend to go with that for a filtration system was a full-blown Bofa 3. And this thing was really expensive for my budget. It was close to $1,000 US, which for me felt crazy at the time. And what I decided was I'll give it a shot. So it starts by measuring the four bolt hole pattern on the enclosure that we're gonna to need to match to. And then that hole measuring the hole size and then going into Fusion 360, designing that basic plate, that sweep and the holes to match, sending that to Cura and then slicing it. I did try cutting it in half a few different ways to see if I could cut down on supports and cut down on time. I wasn't having much luck. Um, this seemed like this was the simplest orientation um, with supports. I prints in roughly six to seven hours, depending on different settings. Question to the community, if you guys have a better way of doing this, I would love to hear that in the, the comments down below. If you like these types of videos, please do hit that like button for me. It helps a lot. Or hit the dislike. I'd love to get your feedback. <laughs> now, if you'd like to see how this Fusion 360 model is done step by step, I'll post that next in the videos. Check out the link. So printing this, uh, printed well. I've got both of them. The quality's okay. Um, it's totally acceptable for this prototype. Once I'm ready to mount this up, um, so you can see the hole is a little small um, in the back there, but um, I'm gonna try this out and see, just make sure the airflow is not restricted too much or impacted. Always nice to have some hardware ready to go. So I bought these kits on Amazon um, just with um, an assortment of metric fasteners. Luckily the, the smallest fits great. Drop those in, assemble it, put it together. The hose slides on and it actually fits really snug. It's almost difficult to get on, which is great. It's not gonna be coming off really easily. And so now it's time to put the, the BOFA through the test, make sure that filtration system's worth the money, see how it performs for me, and I'll report back to the community. I'll see you guys in the next video.